you guys I have made the basically the base for my stew Mommy. and so all right so now that I made the base for my stew I'm going to go ahead and prepare the broccoli the pumpkin and what else do I have, you guys? Oh, and the cauliflower. So I have cauliflower, broccoli, and pumpkin, and that's going to be um, basically what I'm going to put inside the juice, the stew juice. And usually I would have gone, last time when I made this, I went ahead and blended everything up, but truthfully, I did not like the smell of it. Yeah, so I didn't like the smell. I didn't like the smell of the sauce or the stew juice. I didn't like the smell of it. And so I just went ahead and let everything boil you down. Now I actually like it this way instead of the way I made it last time. And so, yeah, so I think it's going to be just as delicious. And last time I didn't add the ginger which I usually add ginger to like all my soups and I did go ahead off camera and I added some sugar so right now I'm gonna go ahead and start cutting up all of my vegetables that I'm gonna put inside the stew okay so
vegetables in. I have the pumpkin, the potatoes. I have the cauliflower and under here I have my broccoli. So I'm just gonna mix it all in. And this time I have a lot more than I had last time, but so I'm just gonna mix that in, and then I'm gonna turn the fire up a bit, just so that way, you know. You just want to go ahead and make sure all of the vegetables are covered in the juice. So that's why I'm, you know. All right. And you just want to make sure everything is mixed in together well. So that's another thing. So I'm going to turn the fire up a bit so that way it can boil you and then I'll let it go ahead and simmer down again. So this is a really good vegetarian meal for anyone who may be a vegetarian. I'm not a vegetarian but lately i've been needing like more vegetables in my life and so i'm just trying to incorporate it all inside one meal and treat it as a main dish the only thing that i would not put in here is the chicken um powder that i put in the chicken broth powder that i put in so you can just you know skip that step but it's looking pretty good if i can say so myself 